Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show you something I made literally like five minutes ago. It's in Python and I converted it to an EX uh, ex executable file for Windows. It's for command line rendering for After Effects and so you don't have to know any code. You just double click, select your After Effects project and you're good to go. So let me show you what I got here. Okay, so here we are in on the desktop here and if you want to do command line rendering you usually have to hit the CMD right, and then and on Mac it's actually the terminal window but the same principles apply uh, so you have to know all this kind of code down here all right to copy and paste like where to find the executable AE render file the flag and then of course the location uh, of your After Effects projects so we'll go ahead and copy that and throw that in there and kind of let it do its thing now this is the way I've been doing it for kind of years and everything like that. It's it's messy, it's manual, and if I want another one, I go CMD, create myself another command render, and then start rendering. And as you can see, it's starting to render here. It did its first frame, this is starting to render. And because I selected uh, um, multi-renders, in the render settings, it's going to skip every other frame, blah, blah, blah. That's pretty standard. So let's go ahead and close these out because that took a little longer to do. Copy, paste, type it out, find all the support information. So now I've created this, this little app right here. It's an exe file. Just double click it. It's like eight lines of code, to be honest with you. It's really simple. And then what it does is bring you up to this dialog box. I don't know why it keeps taking everything to my other monitor. So you just select the After Effects project you want and it launches this for you. And it builds all that code for you without you having to do anything. Now you still have to set it up in the render settings uh, panel of your After Effects project but you don't have to write any code to launch the render file. So I double clicked it, it brought me another window. Again, it keeps putting it on the other window on my other monitor. So like this, and now it's launched another command line renderer for me. Again, I didn't have to type any code in. I just double click, selected the file, and I'm good to go. Now, if you have any questions about doing command line rendering and why, I'm gonna be making another video about that a little bit later. But if you want this program here or the Python script to mess around with, if you're into that sort of thing, just hit me up or put a message at the bottom of the uh, comments and uh, I'll see what I can do about getting it to you. Uh, this is an extreme beta stage. There are some bugs with this. I literally just created it this morning, so don't expect a, a full finished product. But as you can see, it's totally working. It's skipping every other frame because it's a multi-machine render, like a mini render farm if you will and so it's doing its job so yeah that's my new little fun quarantine project have a good one